A veteran in Barnesville is grateful after people heard he was sleeping in his car and decided to do something to get him out of that situation. Yeah, they completely gutted his house and renovated it from top to bottom. Uh, Christy Hutchings with News Radio 1067 shows us the changes that have been made to his home. New appliances, a new bathroom, a new bed. A major transformation from what John Green was living in. Like worn down, it was just riding the porch and things were messed up and all that. It got so bad at times Green would sleep in his car. When Eddie Felton saw just how bad the conditions were, he knew he had to do something. And we had to take out every piece of wood that was in here. Volunteers have worked six, seven days a week to get Green's home back in shape. Felton says the Home Depot Foundation gave them $25,000. The American Legion Post raised money. And countless volunteers gave up their time, including Mr. Watson, who is the contractor. He comes from McDonald every day. We're talking about an hour drive. No money for gas. No compensation. The Lamar County Sheriff's Office pitched in, as well as Barnesville's chief of police. Here you have a police chief that I've never known anyone in my life like him that came in and he was out there himself cutting up tree limbs. And I'm saying, now this is a police chief. This is a picture of Henry County Commissioner Blake Prince and Post Commander Alton Head of Post 516. And the list of volunteers goes on. We have people in this world that really do care about the human beings of concern. For Green, he can't thank everyone enough for their time and efforts to get him back on track. Thank God to the law that he came. In Barnesville, Christy Hutchings, News Radio 1067 for Fox 5 News.